Steve Tarani is a former CIA employee, protective services subject matter expert, and is the lead instructor for a nationally recognized awareness-based training program offered to nearly 3 million members. Tarani is a Central Intelligence Agency and FLETC certified federal firearms instructor who also provides services for the U.S. Naval Special Operations Command and others. Today, Mr. Tarani is an active protective agent, knife designer, published author of nine books, and remains an advisor to the U.S. Department of Justice, U.S. Department of Defense, and the IACP. Think about it from the bad guy's perspective. He sees you in a stable fighting platform, hand up, blade out, knowing what you're doing. Here's the question. Are there softer targets? Yes, that's why they wanted this knife. An organization called ALPA, A-L-P-A, which stands for the Airline Pilots Association, had approached me to deliver training uh, for their group for evaluation for flight deck officer safety. And I asked them, you know, what are some of the features or what demands would you have that were necessary for the pilots that would need to be met by such a knife? One of the most unique and distinctive features of the 737 is the laser etching on both sides of the S30V steel blade. What that does is provide very positive grip, whether you're using your bare hands or gloves, or if it's freezing cold or wet. Another feature is the way the handle starts from a narrow body and moves to a wide body. So starting at narrow, for the smaller fingers and then widening for the larger fingers and the larger part of the hand. So regardless of hand size, there is an optimal position from the narrow body to the wide body expansion. It can be opened three ways. One is with the axis lock. Another method is to use the thumb hole with one hand. And the last one is to use a two-handed method for rapid deployment. More contact equals more control. So the more contact you can have with the blade, the more control you'll have. So it begins by both hands coming together, and then once you have a good grip with your support hand on either side on the laser etching, you then remove the blade and turn the knife, pushing away from your body, and it keeps your other hand away from the front of the blade in the edge and tip or in the forward direction. So if you put all the pieces together, bring the hands together, turn the blade, and reposition the thumb to take advantage of the jimping and extending the handle to the blade. Although specifically designed for the airline industry to include military and commercial pilots, this unique folding blade can be carried by anyone who may have similar demands both on and off duty. If it meets the high demands required of a pilot, it certainly will meet the demands of everyday carriers.